There are simmering allegations of racism coming to a full boil in Soquel tonight. It begins with the suspension of five students at Soquel High School. It all stems from some photographs and allegations that students have formed a white supremacy group. But there's very different stories depending on which side you're listening to. Action News reporter Tom Miller is live at Soquel High tonight with our top story. Well, Aaron, this all started after a group of senior boys wore white T-shirts in their senior panoramic photo. It sounds harmless, but other students say that this, the shirts were a symbol of racism. That was white supremacy at school. This is a public school. You can't show that. Dozens of students rallied in front of Soquel High, calling for peace and unity. We're here to protest all the racial intolerance that has been brought to our school by a certain group of kids. And we're not going to stand for it. This comes after at least five students were suspended for creating a racially intolerant environment on campus. In these photos, you can see some of the students with their arms extended, a sign of white superiority. I've seen swastikas in my econ class that have been drawn. There's swastikas on tables. There's white WP written all over the place. You know, there's people, you see people like throwing up the Nazi salute like during school hours. I'm Jewish. And so for the past four years, I don't think there's been a single classroom that I've been in that hasn't had a swastika drawn on it. And it's gotten to the point for me where swastikas don't mean anything anymore, and it shouldn't be that way. We need to get them out of their little seat of power, because they are terrorizing kids. They're messing with our school. Not everyone agrees with the suspensions, though. Isaiah Harris wore a white shirt today to protest. The way they're doing it isn't right. They should actually have, like, like they should know for sure that they're white supremacists besides just because they wear a white shirt to, on a picture picture day. But Superintendent but Gary Bloom says like the shirts aren't what this is about. It's about ensuring student safety. It's about ensuring a safe school climate. Among those suspended is David Minnie, And although he says he wasn't part of the white supremacist group, he learned a lesson. Not be racist. Don't be throwing up white power. Don't be... I mean, even black power, brown pride, none of that, dude. It's like, it's disrespectful. I don't want to have any conflict. I don't want to have any of these arguments breaking out. School leaders hope this will serve as a learning opportunity that will bring students together. It appears that it already has. And David Minnie's suspension was reduced to two days, and he will be able to attend prom and graduation. Aaron. All right, Tom, thank you. Uh, several other students, however, will miss graduation in prom because of their suspensions.